As part of his BBC Wales show, Rod Gilbert's work experience, the comedian took on the challenge of becoming a junior rugby coach. WRU TV went behind the scenes to see how Rod and his adopted team, Whitland Under 8, got on. Basically, I had a little bit of um, coaching tuition with, uh, with the WRU and uh, did a little bit of the coaching course and, and then was thrown in with a bunch of uh, under 8 from uh, Whitland, as you can see. Uh, Whitland was the team that was chosen. And uh, two weeks later, after two training sessions, one disastrous and one uh, far more successful, I find myself about to go into this, uh, as you can see, rugby festival where I've just got to remind myself that it's not about the winning, it's about the taking part. So the coaching courses we've got set up at the moment are, are level one coaching, and the level one coaching is uh, split into two. So it's for coaches who are coaching from seven to 13, and they come on what we call the children's level one, because uh, it's deemed for those coaching children. And then we've got those who are coaching uh, youths to small adults, so, uh, so 14 plus. Uh, and Rod came down on the uh, on the uh, on the children's level one uh, in Cardiff not so long ago. Kids' enthusiasm is there, isn't it? You know, you you can see it, you can hear it. You chuck a kid on a pitch with a, a ball, and they're they're off. They'll do things themselves. So the heart of it is getting adults involved, I guess. And it's uh, yeah, it's an amazing thing to see all these people, all volunteers. It's first thing on a Sunday morning. It's far too early. I'm normally asleep while this is going on, uh, and they're all out here you know, giving their time. Some of them have got kids involved, but it's not, you know, some of them haven't. And uh, it all, it's all contingent on that. The whole thing rests on whether they come and do it or not. You know? So without them, there's nothing. We want to get as many people into rugby, whether it's making the tea or coaching at level one or have aspirations to go on and coach at a higher level. You know, it's a game for everybody, and I think uh, having Rod um, doing a bit of coaching it just shows that uh, it's accessible to all. We at the Welsh Rugby Union are pushing this massively because... It, it not only sort of hits the holistic side of uh, why we're doing something, it, it's really good that these guys get a knowledge of what they should be coaching. There are so many passionate mums and dads out there who want to get involved. This just gives them maybe a little bit of a tool of, of to get involved in it and what to do when they are involved. So, uh, so yeah, you know, hugely important. The fact that we're upskilling them and their, their knowledge and all we're doing is embracing their passion and two, that then they have the ability and backing of, of us guys at the Welsh Rugby Union to be able to go out and do it and they, they don't have to fear anything in, in what they're doing. In the programme you'll see some progress and, and evolution, you know. It'll, uh, I started to find my feet a bit, you know, and once you know what you're doing with this kind of thing, kids, kids respond to that once you know what you're doing a bit more. So I think uh, hopefully today we'll uh, get out there and smash it. I mean, all take part and have a good time. <laughs>